Welcome to this lesson of Vedic Mathematics. Uh, we're going to learn the formula all from 9 and last from 10. Um, there's nothing that you need to remember specifically uh, regarding this formula. It's just one-liner uh, and it goes just the way it's written all from 9 and last from 10. So, what do we mean by that? So let's use one of our examples from previous chapter. Uh, I've spoken about uh, a number 86. 86. So, <coughs> all from 9 and last from 10. So, all digits from 9 and last last digit from 10 so what do we mean by 9 and 10 so these digits here form your base and what does that do We know that complement of 8 be 1, considering the base is 9. Complement of 6 is 4, considering the base is 10. So oh, our original base of 100, the whole number, we get 14. So a complement of 86 is 14. Let me do some more <coughs> problems so you get a proper hang of this. Let's do a bigger number, a three-digit number. Let's take the number 635. So, all from 9, all from 9, and last from 10. And what do we get? Three, six, five. So six thirty five plus three sixty five is thousand. Now if somebody randomly throws you okay. What is 635? What do you need to add into 635 to get to 1000? Now, in a conventional way, here's what you would have done. So, in a conventional way, you would have done 1000. 635. And you would have said, Okay, boom. This becomes 9, well, technically 10. And then you say, boom. This becomes 10, and this becomes 9. Then you say, oh, okay, this becomes 9, and this becomes 10. And you get 5, you get 6, and you get 3. 365. However, in Vedic math, it's very easy. All from 9 and last from 10. So let's do some more numbers. Let's just say 5 
34. Now instantly you think old from 9, last from 10, so old from 9. So 9 and 5 gives you 4, 6, 6, 466. Now let's see, does that add up to 1,000? 0, and carry 1, 0, carry 1, voila! You get 1,000. That's the conventional way. That's how you would have done it. However, in this method in Vedic mathematics, it is very simple. Let's take a few more examples. Let's just do a larger number. 9, 6, 2, 4. Very arbitrary, right? So, old from 9. So, old from 9. And last from 10. Right? What do you get? Not 0, 6, 3, we know. This would be 7, would be 6. And there's your answer, 376. So complement of 9624 in order to reach 10,000 would be 0, 3, 7, 6. And of course we are not going to write 0. Let's try a few more, Just so that you understand. Let's try a, a large number, uh, arbitrary. Let me take um, uh, 6, 4, 3, 6, 21. Okay, that's a really large number, 643,621. So what would be the base for this? Uh, the base would be 1 million, right? So the complement of this number. So let's do this. See, all from 9, 9, 9, 9, all from 9, and last from 10. What do we get? Complement of 6 would be 3, complement of 4, would be 5, complement of 3 would be 6, complement of 6 is 3, 7, and 9. This should add up to a million. Let's try that out. 9 and 1, 10, and then 10, and then 10, and 10 here, and here as well, and here as well. There we go. So that's our formula, all from 9 and last from 10.